Okay, you guys, I am so excited to show you. The new bar stools are here. Obviously, we still gotta get all this in order, but these are the new bar stools, you guys. I am not in love, but I'm loving them. They're definitely giving clean. They're giving a little bit of industrial with the iron. Um, and it's kind of like a faux leather. So I really like it so far. I'm not in love yet, but I really like it so far. So I'm gonna see, but this is what we're doing for now. Cause we cannot go without chairs. <laughs> so these are the new chairs. I'm gonna pull this out so you can see a little bit better. They are from Wayfair this time instead of Amazon. They do swivel. Oops, let me see. I don't know. I can't swivel it but without me sitting in it. But when you're sitting in it, they do swivel. And we really like them so far. There's no type of cheat feel about them. So that is awesome. All right, you guys. So you've seen our chairs. Now I have to show you everything that we got from Amazon for organization. I've already showed you the cabinetry that we've purchased. Still trying to really get that in order, but I think that these organizational pieces that I purchased will really, really help to organize everything else that we're trying to figure out. So let me show them to you. So y'all, this is our old dining set from our apartment, obviously. Um, we don't have our other table yet, but this is what i got from amazon they each came with two and i purchased four of them so this is what it will do underneath those cabinets remember i showed you our cabinets don't have drawers or anything so we really needed to use all of that space that's down there and figure out you know how to really organize our stuff so we have four of these i'm thinking i'm not even thinking about the for these i'm not thinking about our downstairs bathroom at all this is only for drew's bathroom and then our master bathroom um and really well because they each come with two so i got eight of them actually i said i got four i actually have eight here so we're gonna see how it works out i'm gonna let y'all know how i end up using it i also purchased this for in the sink storage from simple human so I'm excited for this to really get together those sponges, the brushes and things like that. And then we have this box here and I wanna show you guys what's in here. Okay, uh, so I purchased this from Amazon as well. So I purchased this and then I saw the cutest jewelry box on Amazon and now I'm just like should I get the jewelry box and send this back or should I keep this for under the storage or under the counter storage um just as maybe my makeup grows as I get more jewelry and things like that so I bought this for under the counter to go with these for my side of the sink um and it also comes with these really large drawers, which I didn't even know it came with this, but it's all stackable, so it all stacks. And it comes with these drawers as well. Um, so yeah, trying to figure out what I wanna do here and see how it works out. also purchased this here you can see the picture for the cabinet in the master bathroom so that I could put my hair dryer my flat iron and those types of things in this little thing and it's supposed to hang on the on the door so that's what this is for okay so you guys know we have the wood thing going on so I had to get this for I already opened it. I haven't used it yet. It needs to be cleaned. That's why I haven't used it yet, but got this to go up on the sink. It is, you push it down. 
and it bubbles up. So now you have soap on there and you can go ahead and like clean. Um, I just thought it was the perfect addition to the other wood accents that we have going on. So yeah, Amazon. So we've had this for a minute, but I just want to show it to you. But it is an electric, it's dirty. Got to clean it and I have to refill it. With you, like this, this is awesome, especially for Corona. And really just, I think even before Corona, this would have been an awesome thing to have. But you put your hand underneath and it's an automatic soap dispenser. So we have this on the kitchen sink as well. And so that's what this is, y'all. All types of stuff going on. But I wanted to show it to you guys. I didn't purchase this recently. We actually had this like when we first moved in. But I wanted to show it to you guys. So automatic soap dispenser. Okay, so then I also purchased this marble like tray. It's a sink tray. I initially purchased it for the sink, the kitchen sink. However, you've seen the marble that we have, and I'll try to insert like a video clip here, but I just don't think that this is not really giving me what I wanted to give on that, or granite. It's not giving, I don't like it compared to the granite. So I'm gonna try to put this in our guest bathroom downstairs and see how it works. So you guys will see that later on in this video. And then I bought this. So this came in a pack of two. Here's the other one. I might put it in Drew's bathroom, but Drew's bathroom doesn't have the black theme going on. His bathroom has more of the navy blue and gray theme going on. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do. But anywho, using this currently, at the kitchen sink because I feel like this goes a little bit better than the than the white marble um and so yeah Amazon I, I love them all I do I still love them I love this I think it's gorgeous um I think it's a nice little addition to my decor um but it just it's, it doesn't go with I feel like it doesn't go with our our granite so I'm gonna show you these, but you'll see more of these later in this video. I bought like, I think they, these came in a pack of four. So I bought two, so I have eight. The only thing is for the bathroom downstairs, I only wanna use two and then maybe, so basically ear swabs, cotton balls, and then the teeth flossers. You guys will see it later in this video. That's three things. And so my bathroom, Drew's bathroom, and then the guest bathroom. But since I only purchased two packs of four, the guest bathroom will only end up getting ear swabs and the cotton balls. And I'll figure out what I'm gonna do with the, um, the teeth flossing. But excited to get these going so y'all can see. They come with this little acrylic container with the top, Amazon, of course. And so you guys will see these later in the video. Okay, so this next buy, you will definitely get me and understand if you are somebody that keeps all of your grocery bags. Like, I feel like grocery bags are reusable. I feel like that is my contribution to the world when I reuse grocery bags as garbage bags, as whatever it is I need to use them for. But child, we got so many and we brought some of our bags from our apartment I don't know how they got here. I think the movers just, they were like, yeah, well, they must want these, right? They didn't throw them out, so let's bring them. So I purchased this. <laughs> this is also from Amazon. It's from Simple Human. And basically it is a bag holder. So you put the bags in there and then you pull the bags out. So I'm hoping that this will, this will solve our issue because right now we have so many i don't even want to so show it to you guys it's kind of embarrassing because at the same time i'm like dang do every let me know in the comments below like do you guys keep grocery bags and if you do what do you use them for let me know in the comments below if you guys keep grocery bags but i'm hoping that this will solve our issue um and yeah because we got literally a whole thing of cabinets is being taken up by grocery bags right now. And I feel like I need to put as much in here that I can put in here. And if it doesn't fit, I am I can give it to the recycling people when they come pick it up every Wednesday, okay? Because it's, yeah, it's a lot.
Okay guys, so last but certainly not least from this Amazon haul was some oven mitts, a silicone oven mitt. And it came in a whole set. So this actually is a really nice box. Um, it came in a, 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 a huge set. So 500, de 500 degree heat resistance, nice slip honeycomb surface, 15 inches of forearm protection, organic cotton quilted liner, hand and machine washable, waterproof and easy to clean, and hidden hanging loop so that you can hang it up. So I'm gonna take this off the box and show it to you guys. And it's not just the oven mitt. It actually is, so it came with two of these. <laughs> two of these. My grandma used to call them hot plates. Do you guys call these hot plates? But you know, you put your pots and your pans on it when it's hot and you don't wanna mess up your counter. So, came with two of these. And then it also came with two mitts. It has like a plastic smell, I guess. Not a terrible smell. If you guys are frequent shoppers with Amazon, then you know sometimes some of this stuff will come smelling crazy, okay? Finally have that, guys, because I don't know how we've been surviving without any type of mitts for to cook. Just ridiculous. And so... I'm going to take you guys into the guest bathroom with me really quickly to kind of get that set up so you can see what that's going to look like. And then I'm going to see what I can get done. Um, my goal is to really get as much done as possible because we leave tomorrow to go on a trip for our friend's birthday. We are going to Miami and my sister will be here with Drew for the weekend. So, yeah, I need to get done as much as possible. So let's see if we can get done. Okay, so here we are in the guest bathroom. We still have just a few things, I would say. Not even a few, like there's a lot that we still need to do in here, but we have added some things since we've been here. It's been officially, it's now June, so it's been a, a month and some days. And so, yeah, it's kind of coming along slowly but surely, but I'm so glad, be, I'm so glad you guys are here with me on this process and this journey because I know that I'm gonna probably like switch some things up. Um, so yeah, here we go. So, as you can see here, I've already washed and cleaned the containers. This we purchased probably a few weeks ago. Um, this is kind of like the theme for this bathroom, like this nice bronzy brown with matte black to kind of tie into the things we have going on in the kitchen since this is the downstairs bathroom the upstairs bathrooms have minds of their own um but yeah this is kind of what we have going on down here this is just some incense you guys from walmart it's like maple flavored or something yeah uh, it smells like my grandma or my aunt from growing up. I don't know if you guys have any old heads in your families that actually used to burn incense, but that's kind of what it smells like. I don't plan to burn it at all. I just brought it, I just put it in here for the ambiance because I'm not gonna put the Q-tips or anything like that in here, which is what this is for. It's not gonna be for toothbrushes or anything like that because it's just a guest bath. So that's this. I know it keeps cutting my head off, but that's this. And we got this. And this from Target. It was a it was an entire set. So that's that. And then, like I said before, I initially purchased this for the kitchen, but I think I'm gonna use it in here instead, just to bring some more warmth to the area. Or not more warmth, because white white is not necessarily warm, but just more white to the area, so it's not so dark. Um, because we do plan to change this faucet out for matte black. Um, we have our we already have the faucet; it's just a matter of getting it put in. So I'm gonna be using this one instead, like I showed you earlier. Or I'm sorry, no, this is what I initially purchased, but I've just I'm gonna use it in the kitchen instead. So I just want to show you guys that. As you can see over here in the corner, right here. I don't know if you can see me right here that's that air freshener i showed you in the last vlog and then we just have some kleenex from my mother-in-law when she was here so this is the only cabinet in our home that has like the drawer in this space so this is what we have for guests 
This lotion, I plan to change soon. I do not actually recommend it, you guys. My dad loves this lotion, but I feel like it's kind of watery. But for now, it's in our guest bath. Some alcohol, this is some Listerine, and then there's some soap back there. And then I also wanted to show you this. So some toilet paper down here for the guests. And then I bought this rug here from the Dollar Tree. So you see toilet bowl cleaner, uh, wipes, and then some air freshener. Um, but I have this mat in every single cabinet. So as we go from cabinet to cabinet, you guys will see. I'm super excited to show you what our cabinet looks like as well in the kitchen now because it looks so much more organized so much more put together so not only did we have like oil stains and soap stains and things like that on the base of the cabinet from soap bottles and oil and stuff like that but it just was starting to really discolor the cabinets and i couldn't change it like i, I couldn't clean it it wouldn't come off and so i'm gonna show you guys that obviously as we keep going but let's get back to the bathroom mm -hmm. 